Uh huh. We know that this is entirely useless. W why are the roads even reinforced? Like, this is just crazy. I think we all know what needs to be done here. Because an extra plane here is not going to stop our spring cannon. It's not. Alright. So now, let's do some springs. So we're going to do a short little road here. And then what I'm just going to basically do is a nice little spring muscle. Now, hopefully a spring muscle does get me there. It would be kind of embarrassing if, um... <laughs> If it turns out that the spring muscle only gets me a top 2% and everyone did the two muscle contraption, that would suck. Uh, let's move this over a bit, I think. So move this up and then short road and then something like this. Send them to space like Kerbal. Yeah, true. If we can launch a car into space, we can launch a rocket into space. It's basically the same thing. All right, so compress. Compress, 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 and then stretch this a bit. 50%. All right, here we go. Didn't get that far. All right, let's uh, change up the angles here. Maybe stretch this out more. Oh, guys, this is getting expensive. But it's getting a bit more power. Just a bit more stretch. Okay, the angle just isn't quite right that we're hitting it. How about this? Oh, there we go! <laughs> A little front flip. 2800. I hate springs. I hate springs. God. People were able to do this with just two springs, kind of like this. Give or take. Something like that. I don't know if the, how, how they exactly did it. But, see, I mean, that gives some decent height, right? So there's gotta be some merit. I don't hate springs, I hate what people do with springs. True, true, true. That's fair. You know, honestly, I was thinking about springs. If springs, if you were unable to preemptively compress or stretch springs, I think they'd be a fine element. If they were just something like rope or cable, but they had a lot of flexibility, like you just placed the spring and couldn't adjust it, I think that'd be, I think that would be pretty neat. I think that would still be fun without allowing this sort of cheese to happen. Although, to be fair, this part of cheese is integral to Polybridge. Like, I can't shit on that too much. Because, you know, the cheese is exciting for the viewer. I get it. It still sucks to do. It, do it doesn't make it fun to do. It, like, I enjoy watching other people do spring cans rather than doing a spring can myself. But if I was to balance it, I think I personally would have made it so that you couldn't preemptively compress or stretch it. It's pretty close. There's nothing morally wrong with doing it. I think I'm taking it from a selfish streamer perspective, right? Where I want to be constantly narrating and doing strategy and explaining complicated stuff to you. Where the strategy behind this is just tweak a pixel. Sure, it's selfish, but that, you know, that's still my angle from it. Yeah, you know, that's, that's still how I feel about it, you know? Because I can't really explain much except I'm going to move this a few pixels this way. I'm going to move this a few pixels that way. I think another thing that kind of sucks is that the leaderboards are basically solved. It's one design beats all. I mean, which, uh, to be fair, that's most levels. Nah, you know what? I don't care that much about it. It just sucks as a streamer. That's, that's basically it. I don't think there's anything wrong with cheese. I just, I just want you guys to know my official stance on the spring cannon. Like, again, there's nothing wrong with using it. <laughs> it's just really, uh tedious unless if chat's like no please keep tweaking these pixels i live for the spring pixel tweaking that's this is just gonna be like this so i have a vertical one and a horizontal one this is my vertical this is my horizontal i need more horizontal so i will ooh, add more horizontal i'm really good at launching it straight up but i just want this to be longer so it goes over more. Oh, look at that shit, it's so close. Come on. Yeah, it hit, but it didn't rotate right. So it's like somewhere in here. That gets like maximum distance. If I move this, it probably gets less distance. Oh, but maybe. Maybe if I get lucky enough. Now we lose distance the more we move this in. This is, I, I, and I continue to move it in for some reason. So let's move it out. Oh, this is interesting. 
Okay, this is sliding out instead of pushing down. Whoa. So it needs to either not flip or... I don't know, add another spring? Change the roads, possibly? <gasps> oh, the road change was kind of nice, I think. If I move this down, it should have less of rotation. Add more. So I move it this way. Unbelievable. All right, what if I lower this a tad? <gasps> no way, it's so close. Yes, 1900. Holy shit, that barely made it up. I'm not doing this anymore. Next level, please. Just like all great levels, I decided to finish this one off stream. This time I provided you guys some footage so you guys can see me endlessly tweaking pixel by pixel. It wasn't too hard to get done, but it was really tedious. And if I'm not in the mood to do pixel tweaking, it's just gonna be a lot worse. But yeah, you can see me getting cheaper and cheaper and cheaper on this design in the echelons of top 1%, eventually landing on the successful design for $1,878. That's enough to get me third place. Pretty solid. And back to you, Past Tyler. Uh, let's do the Big Dipper. So, this design is jank. This actually might be the hardest one of the day. Because I'm gonna be honest, I'm not good at this. I might look at the leaderboard for inspiration. The people, the dangling fucking roads. Dear God. Actually, you know what? Hold on, that idea is, that idea is totally replicable. That's 100% replicatable. Um, because what I'm gonna do is basically get rid of that and do just the reinforced dangling road. Wow. Uh, dangling road. Cool. Sick. Something like this. And then what I'm gonna do is replace this entire road with the spring. And I think this one, uh, shit. This one's gonna be here. And then this one's also gonna be this. And we're gonna also have a spring on that. Let me just see if this holds. <sighs> Alright, so... Uh, as you can see, there's definitely some issues, uh, but it holds on its own before this guy has something to say about it. Right, so the road itself snaps. So what do you th I think I need to do is lower this. I wonder if I need a spring on this side as well. What they also had was a little road drop off. I didn't think I need that, but I guess I could do that. And then lower this even more. This is so... Definitely not it. Oh my gosh, but that even holds for a bit. That is ridiculous. I'm gonna redraw this, I think. What am I doing? This does need to curve, and I'm dumb. Alright, so that holds for now. Let me just see if this makes it across. Um, so it kind of makes it across, but this dangles way too damn low. And then it's not going to make it up there. But it actually does make it this far, which is really interesting. I just want to see if I can make it up without the help, or even without the star. I'll get the star later, I just want to get a working design. Just so I can know that this works, so I can tweak it later. Hmm. Okay, it's getting really steep, so I'm going to contract. Sorry, stretch. Okay, that holds. And you know what? Maybe maybe I'll do like a little help here. Like this. And then what I'm going to do next is compress here. Like, let's see if this makes it up. What about without this? Because the catching road part's going to be really weird. Let me have this not compress as much. Maybe 10%. Well, that was the best yet. All right, so now we need more springs. Or do we want it to tumble? I don't know. <laughs> I, I really don't know. That was really weird. Maybe a double spring to here? And then have these both compress a bit? Ah, it just has so much speed going into this. Also, can I get, have this be non-fortified? It, it doesn't really do much. It's kind of a stabilizer. 
<laughs> this is so stupid. What the fuck? No! Are you kidding me? That sticks the landing. Oh my god, this game is whack. It's gonna tip over backwards. We can fix this next though. This this was crazy. Like what happens is at the front of it, it's whatever it is, it's push hits the wall and then that causes it to tip over. That's hilarious that it holds though. I cannot believe that. All right, we're gonna go back to budget, I think. Or not budget, our test thing. And then I'm gonna redo the brace. So even though this uh, does not need to be a reinforced road, it somehow has a butterfly effect on the rest of the bridge. Hmm. Yeah, the whole thing just gets too steep. Can I do some sort of double? Maybe it doesn't even need to be a spring. Just the double road catch like this. Oh, that's just still too steep. Let's see if I can make this more shallow then. Hmm. The back wheel kind of hits this and then it has an issue. So what I'm gonna do is lower this even more and then bring this out more. Bring this out to like here. Nice. There we go. We just need a better catching road. That's it. 15,900. Oh, top 10! Wow! That was not that challenging at all. That was actually really clean. Do I need this at all? Almost works. That... If we, if we get rid of that, I'm satisfied. It just picks up so much speed. This is like the final boss of dangling roads that you face after beating 70 dangling roads in a row. Oh, that was so close! Come on. No way! What is that? It overturns! The back wheel comes back down and ruins me. That's crazy. Do I even need this road to be out long? Maybe. Oh, well, it holds! Does it make it up now is the question. Because I changed up some stuff in the back. It might not latch onto this as well. It's probably going to tip over. Wait, it doesn't though. It just doesn't and we shaved 500 bucks. Yo! Eighth place. All right, hold on. Let's go for 15k. Sub 15,000, top five. Can I have this be regular? Just say for a fat 70 bucks. Oh, I could finally make it a regular road. Nice. All right, seventh place. Let's keep pushing. This is the most fun I've ever had with the dangling road, and I want to cherish this moment. What about this? Can I do this? Oh, that's, that's, that's not cheaper. Hmm. What if I change it like so? Oh, so close. Let me try the whole thing just being less steep. Wood instead of road. That's not a bad thought, actually. I mean, it doesn't get me there. But I like where your head's at. Yeah, because we don't even drive on that road. Alright, I think I'm going to do this off stream more, if if I decide to. Top seven's still really nice, but it's getting definitely confusing. Anything you think would work will not work, and I can guarantee that. Everything has a, such a weird uh, consequence that you can't really math out. Uh, but yeah, no, this was this was still nice. I'm glad this was more fun than expected. Oh, top six, not top seven. Sixth place, very cool. Still top seven, but also top six. Anyways, we're going to go to the next level. What do we got? Compression! Uh, wait, what's the challenge on this? You added the boat... Okay, right, ah, uh, yeah, so this one, this one's strange. This one's definitely strange. This design's not that great. I think I could do a lot better with more springs, and then the top could be way better. 
This is gonna be interesting. Uh, yeah, because people got a third of my budget. I kind of want to do like two dangling roads or something. Or a dangling road on top with springs. And then this. I think I'll double spring this for now. Since we know this sort of thing works real well. And then... Just maybe a normal arch for the bottom. Just temporarily. Maybe with some um, over-under action going on. And uh, I'm stuck with the uh, spring dangling road design. I'm just hoping it can work. Oh! Wait, it has potential. Do we think this guy can push up the road then? I think so. I mean, it's just the road. That, that's not bad. Oh, are you joking? The had potential. That's not terrible at all. I really think this has a chance. We could try to hold it up, I guess. Wow, that holds surprisingly well. Well, uh, please stay. No, okay, this is quite good. I guess this does hold. Uh, so now I just need to fix this arch. This is only 200 bucks. But this looks better, right? Because it just uses ropes. Ropes are normal materials. Now we're not using ugly reinforced roads as support. That's pretty cool. I Hold on. Does it take away stress from the side roads? I wasn't watching. This one could probably become a normal road again. Yeah, look at that. This is not go undergoing... Oh, it's undergoing a bit. Oh, it does get bad. I'm going to I'm gonna still try it. it. It does get bad. I think it's going to break. I think, I think it is going to break. But I'm so glad that it doesn't. Hallelujah. Top 3%. Uh, next, I guess we do wood ropes. Let me make sure this works, and then I'll probably fix this road. This one seems to undergo less stress than that. Oh, what is going on here? Bruh. This, you are not correct. You are not functioning as rope. Do we even need this? Well, I, obviously we need something. But this is not doing its job. Still works. <laughs> I guess if it gets the job done. Uh, 50 seconds. What if I bring this back? Hold up. I wish save a little money. Sure. Sure. Sure, we, we saved 20 bucks. Wow, that's pretty strong. I think I need to fix these roads themselves. But look at the strength on this. It's just this bit in the middle kind of goes bad. Maybe maybe this should be a rope. And then this should be a rope as well. Alright, so I'm glad I didn't try to attach the bridges. That would have been a major waste of time. I was worried about that. See if I can get these ropes to be straight. If they're straight, then hopefully this road will stay static. Please don't move around. Nice! Nice! 11,000. That's huge. 49... Uh, why did I was about to say 4,900? Just 49th place. 49th place. Not bad. It's, it's, it's getting there. Can I maybe get rid of one of these springs? How about this one? Oh god, this is stressed now. Yes! We needed that spring before, but now it's gone. Barely 99% stress and barely top 1%. That's crazy. That is actually insane. Wow. Good deal. Can I shave a little bit more, though? I should look at that stress. Oh, uh, that was sick. Like, the next thing I'm thinking about is this spring. We all know that's not going to work. Well, we don't know that's going to work. We don't know shit. Turns out, nobody knows anything about springs. What am I doing? I'm so hooked on that old design, I never stopped to try the new one. All right, top 10. Wow. Uh, <laughs> that sucks. Well, it doesn't suck. It's actually good. I don't, I don't know why I'm I was upset. We're, we're, we're killing it. 10th place. Can I do this yet? 
constantly on the top of the truck. Oh, that was good. That was really good. It's eighth place. Hold on. Hold on. This one then too? Oh, you're kidding me. This would be fourth place, I believe. No! Hold on. Raise this up. Shit. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Oh, it's so close. I don't I don't think it's going to quite get it. pretty slick <laughs> that's fourth place the cheapest of this design i think everyone who got cheaper at least on the current leaderboard it might not even be updated but as far as i can tell i got the cheapest of this design everyone ahead probably did a different design nice fourth place let's keep moving